I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go over a box, basically like a tote or an outdoor crate for like gardening tools or any type of tools working around the yard. Or you could put it poolside and keep all your pool toys in here or things to work on your pump or cleaning your pool or something like that. I've been needing one of these for a while and I finally picked me one up. And I'm just gonna, let's just go over the dimensions of this thing real quick. So it's 49.21 inches lengthways and um, height weighs it or height it's 24 point like eight that way and 4.5 that way so it's going to be able to slide a lot of stuff down in it and just store whatever you need and it comes in three colors gray graphite and black and i obviously got the gray and that's what they checked there and looking at it this is exactly how it came i have not opened it you know i have my little next tool knife here i'm going to go ahead and cut it open and let's um let's see what this thing is and how hard it is put together all right i just cut it out of the box here let's go ahead and put the little knife up and looking over it right here's what you get you get an owner's manual and you know it's it tells you right here it's a hundred gallon deck box is what they're calling it and then there is a little bit of assembly but but you can see right here, it's almost like putting together Lego pieces. You have two sides, a bottom, two sides, two end pieces, and a top, and you're done. It looks like they do give you a little bit of hardware right here, so I might have to open that up and see how that hardware is, but I do like it when the companies give you pictures and label each one A, B, C, D, E, and then a screw, and then a hydraulic rod, so that means it's gonna come up slow and lower slowly. How cool is that? So yeah, let me go ahead and stick all this together, and let's see what this thing looks like, so let's do that now. What I do like, they've actually multiplied Folded in the letters. See how that has an E right there? Okay, this thing went together extremely simple. They actually have up molded into the, the plastic here. So you have C and C on this side, and it's got up there, it's got up there, and they just basically snap in the bottom of this D. So the D's facing up, and then you see how these little mechanisms right here connected very easy snap together and i press down on it and it all snaps together now i'm going to screw the lid on because the lid's going to have those brackets that are holding it on and that's the only real assembly you're going to have to do which looks like it's only like five six screws so let's do it right, everybody i just got it put together that thing was super simple just the, the, the two end pieces the two sides it all snapped together it actually has up on it there's four screws to go on the hydraulic lifts right here and check it out check out how smooth what an awesome box this is what's this is that not awesome? That's almost like the, the back end of a hatchback car or something. It actually has hydraulic lips on it. A deck box with hydraulic so lips. So what I got it for basically was like, say I got this little small um, add a tree blower right here and my alloy man blower, hedge trimmer and a little saw. That's the ICO hedge trimmer, um, a drill. And I'm gonna use it for tools. So let's check this out. And look how much room is in here. Like I said, it's a hundred gallons. Look at this, everybody. And there's still room this ain't even started what I can put in this thing. How awesome is this? Look at this. I can load this down, and this is going to be in my backyard kind of as my garden setup. I'm still going to put more in here. I think I have a lawnmower that will go in here. I got a little real lawnmower that I'm also going to put in here. So, yeah, there you go, everybody. That's all I got today on the 100-gallon deck crate. See you all in the next video. Woo!